Now we are going to see how assemble the component that we are model. First, I going to insert and place the lines, and then I right click and fix it because it will be act a base for many component. Then I am going to insert sun key and bringing it here. So what I am going to do? I am going to use the sliding. So sliding mid I am selecting, and I choose the place where my sun key going to fit on the edge, and sun key as well as the for the lines the page I am choosing carefully after clicking after selecting those edges I will just automate how the assembly is going on so find it is going correctly and I give it a now I will find the sun key is assembled on flange properly now I am going to insert a shop here I place shop nearby near the flange and Again, I am going to use the mid command here. Sliding mid when I am using here, I was choosing the shaft end and also choosing the flange end. So, shaft end is not fitting properly. I was carefully choosing the shaft face. Yes. Like this. Now it was made properly. I just uh, automate how the sliding is occurs. So it is going perfectly. Now the slant hole is uh, misaligned. So I am using the angular rotation option to fit exactly with the sun key under the shaft slant also. So now the assembly of the shaft is over. Now I am going to insert flange or a portion of flange. I am going to insert using insert key. I am going to get another flange, paste another flange by using insert command. Here we go. And then I am going to use filter to make here. I reverse it. Actually, so I want to make the uh, exact angle of that uh, thing also just to find selecting sliding and yes, just change the angle of the wings and then I'm going to change the angle of slat hole also. Now we just check the movement. That movement is in one direction, so I was giving minus 50m. So it will move from left side to right side. So I increase the distance of minus 150. So the movement of the flange is properly from the line to the right to the here. So now plans is assembled with the other plans and then as for the module that we see earlier, the key wall slide is in our particular again in section key. And previously I select the sliding mid here and carefully select the where it is going to meet and I'll rotate it. Of that alignment here, the angle is using bound edge, so again, I will use the right edge. Yes, now I have this correct. Zooming it and look exactly what angle is using. Now I just to rotate it properly. So I understand for understanding for this, I just want to rotate it. Now, this sun key is aligned properly and it moves also correctly to this coming. So I'm going to 
Kan bisa selesai dulu semua. No, we're going to assemble the shelf. So I'm going to insert the shelf. And we're going to close. No, I'm going to use the sliding wheel. Sliding wheel. Carefully choose the face of the shelf. And then I'm going to choose the inside end of the shelf. And so we've got the second one, not the same, this is the body. So, see, it's fine, it's new. No, the direction is the opposite, so I want to move on again. It's fine, 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 fine. So it's new, right here. So now, some words of the rotation is like that. Precisely, but the shaft turn the sun key. Also, I can do match it. So, now it is matching. So, assembly of the shaft to the key or the point or whatever. Now, now I'm going to add molten metal assembly here. Just choosing the external bolt assembly here. So, I'm going to insert external bolt. Closing the other one with the plants. And then I'm placing them at the opposite side of the plant and do it with my focus. I'm going to use the cylindrical sliding. So cylindrical sliding, fourth of the plant I'm choosing first, and then at edge which is going to be up in the I select most and the rivetic about it. So now I just to see and then the dominant is uh, Directions are not the best way to have this. A few minutes, just for a moment. I'm so not efficient, so I'll do my best. A few minutes. So now the moment is correctly coming. Looks like it's all in switching. So now I'm going to unleash this button. So now this bolt is assembled here. And I'm going to assemble the mat here. For that, I'm going to hide the mat bolt for the of uh, assembling so I just stay hiding that bolt here I select the minimum one of the bolt and then selecting the sound edge of the mic also here carefully yeah. selecting both of these and so I'm hiding cylindrical sliding now you see the things is looking good happening I just revert it just to automate just to going to give a minus 50 here to come in front of me, 0 so now at this point in front of me so I am going to hit that bolt now bolt in assembly is over here, the main three issues I am going to use a flat pattern like the model that I can repeat and then number I am for the axis and shaft I am selecting so the moment I select it, the all four nuts are button board assembly finalized. So this is transmitting assembly.